Hello everybody, I am thrilled to announce that we now offer TikTok integration. So you can publish to all your TikTok channels, you can schedule your TikToks, you can have reposts, and there's just very few limitations. We will go through what those limitations are, uh, but not until we give you a demo of how this is going to work. Please watch till the end. This is a two-step process, the way that TikTok handles this. So we'll go through that in just a second. First step is you're gonna to wanna to go over to your um, account preferences and just make sure you add all of your TikTok accounts just like you normally would any other social network account. Then you can jump back over to the publisher and publish your TikTok. So on this particular demo, we're gonna choose TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn just to show you how you can incorporate your video publishing across a whole bunch of different networks all in one step. So I'm gonna write my text, which I've already done here. And next thing I'm gonna do is upload my video. Just drag the file up there. Very good. Next thing, I'm gonna add some hashtags. So yes, we do support hashtags with um, TikTok. So what you do here is I'm going to go and add some TikTok hashtags because I haven't done that yet. So as you can see, we now offer TikTok hashtags in your hashtag groups. So what I'm going to do is just grab all of my Instagram ones and paste them here for this demo. But of course, you can always add more. So let's add TikTok here. And then finally, we will save this. And we're going to randomly pick five for each one of our posts. Perfect. So next step is I can add an image here or a link here if I want to. And yes, we have a completely separate link shortener just for TikTok. So any people who visit your um, link from your TikTok post, you'll be able to monitor that separately and get reporting. Not only that, we have total engagement and view reporting with TikTok. We're going to go through that too very shortly. Very exciting. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some hashtags to this. So notice how it dropped all my hashtags in, so that's ready to go. Um, next thing I'm gonna note here is that TikTok will notify me when it's time to post. This is just a reminder that TikTok is a two-step process. What's going to happen here is, if I schedule this to go out tomorrow at five o'clock in the afternoon, at five o'clock tomorrow, I'm gonna to get a notification from TikTok, from their app, saying that the video's been uploaded and it's ready to publish. So we'll go through that actually on our phone, what's going to happen at that time. But just so you understand, when you click publish, it's not actually gonna go and you know be seen in your TikTok stream. Um, it's actually going to go to the TikTok app and wait for you to add the caption, um, which we help with. And it's also gonna wait for you to maybe add any filters or anything else that you wanna do that is you know popular on TikTok, maybe add music or something like that. Um, we also have the switch here. I would leave this on. What we do that's a little different than the other um, competitors that we have, we actually email you the caption when it's time to post. That way when you get to that step in your TikTok app, TikTok app um, you're not going to have to just sit there and think of something to say, think of all those hashtags. Um, we're actually gonna send it to you via email so you can jump into your email app on your mobile phone and grab that, copy it, and then paste it into the caption in TikTok. So I'm gonna go over that workflow too. Um, the next step though is I'm gonna add my categories. So we're gonna call this um, a, let's see, an awareness campaign. So we tag that category so when our reporting we'll be able to filter for that. Um, I'm not going to repost, but if I wanted to, I could absolutely repost based on our queue or a number of weeks away or days away. Um, I'm not going to do that. Um, also, here, you can add to queue, publish now, schedule, optimal, save as draft. Those are all available for your TikTok posts. But what I'm gonna do is publish now, and let's see how this thing works. So right now, it's gonna be pushing this video as a live direct post to Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. TikTok is receiving this video right now, and they're gonna be pushing it out to my mobile device. And then I will be um, joining you guys on my mobile phone so you can watch that screen and see what happens there.
Okay, so this is the email I received on my mobile device from Socialmonials. Your TikTok video is ready, will always be the subject line. First thing you're gonna do is, um, you're gonna wanna copy all of this. So just hold it down and do a nice drag copy. Then jump into TikTok. Go to your inbox after you watch your office bloopers. So at the very top, you're gonna to see um, that your video is there. I did this a while ago, so here's my, under today, you see TikTok platform, your video from Campaign Chair is ready. So this is the screen you're gonna see. Um, by the way, if you have notifications turned on for your TikTok app, you'll get an app notification on your screen. Um, but I wanted to show this for all the people that have TikTok notifications turned off. You can always just jump into the inbox. So click on the very top one, that's the latest video. And we use Campaign Share because that's our white label mobile app. Here's our video, you can add your filters and then click next. From here, I'm gonna paste my entire caption that includes my hashtags and any links that you have. And then hit post, you're done. So now that you've posted your video, you'll be able to check out the reports in the left column here. And once you jump into your reports, um, you can scroll down and see all of your TikTok engagements and some other things. So you can view your clicks, your engagements, um, comments, likes and favorites. Well, in this case, it would be your likes and your shares. You can even see if somebody shares it. So engagements is basically, it's gonna add up your likes and your comments. And at the very bottom, we've added something called TikTok views. That way you could see just how many people have viewed your post. So I wanna go over some of the limitations real quick. Just note that you can always jump into our help file to find this. And I'm gonna enter TikTok. So this has a list of how to post and down at the bottom, the limitations. So the size of the file must be equal or lesser to 50 megabytes. So you, this is a TikTok limitation, not ours. So you'll find that you might need to reduce the resolution on your recordings in order to get any decent length video uploaded. And the total duration must be three seconds minimum, 60 seconds maximum. The supported video file formats are MP4 and, and WebM. And the resolution must be at least 540 pixels wide. That's it. Looking forward to seeing the TikToks you guys put out there. And thank you for listening.